as you can see, bro, this is a long-awaited video. I've been postponing this shit. Hey, we ain't calling this nigga Adam no more. Adam 22, that shit dead. It's Cuck 22. His name is Cuck 22. Let's get to it. So where you was, uh, I sent you on the internet, you was somewhere. Where you was at? What I was at? Ruga. We went to Italy, France, and Spain on our honeymoon for a month. Yeah, I was traveling and traveling. Yeah. Speaking of. Are you going to do it? <laughs> I ain't not this early. These not are the yet. rules of the podcast. Come I on, have Ruger. to explain myself. Get on his weird ass. Person not yet. I ain't gonna, I'm going to save it. <laughs> At gosh. some point, I might even have to like lay down the ground rules of like, hey. Because I never had that. You go do an interview and people are like, is there anything you don't want to talk about? I'm always like, nah, I can talk about whatever. Yeah, but. I might have to do that on my own interviews. Only rule. Yo, only why is this nigga me? acting like what he did wasn't just some weird shit? You know? I ain't kink shit, man. Bro like to see his bitch get fucked, you know, by some BBC shit. Yeah, that's what turned him on. But you just can't be putting this shit on the internet, bro. You got kids, nigga. Your son, go, your son or daughter going to see this shit one day. That's weird as fuck. What's wrong with him, bro? It's, tell us what's wrong with the world nowadays. We let niggas like him just do bullshit on the internet, bro. Like, what the fuck? And that little kid going to see that shit. It's just weird, bro. A lot of... As Solomnati would say, he he in the Matrix, bro. He's the, he's part of the Matrix, bro. About redacted. Nah, I don't mind. It's just at a certain point, it might look kind of. You don't if mind. I talk about on every podcast. I think you might do. <laughs> Let us <laughs> ask no Ruga. What the fuck? <laughs> you think you I'm tripping that hard? Nah, you ain't tripping, but you tripping. Yo, Ruga just mm. like a GD you for good, real, man. I ain't gonna lie, my man. I could talk about it. Go crazy. I don't want to be, you know what I'm saying, but let loose. I seen it, you know what I'm saying. And my <laughs> thing is like, you um, let another, you know what I'm saying, man. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Enter. Fuck the shit out his wife. So it's like for work, video content. Hey, no homo, bro. They tell my bro got a motherfucking anaconda on him. I know this nigga Adam. My fault. Cuck twenty two was shitty as hell when he seen that shit, bro. Like, oh my god. That's disgusting, bro. It's for content. Yeah. I get it, though. You know what I'm saying? For content. We're but, in the business now. But you know? this is the thing, though. What if he laid it down better and a motherfucker just like what they like? Well, like better. I mean, even if he did lay it down better, that just means that I personally need to step my game up. Yeah. So that I can, you know, compete. And then what if... It's just fear. This nigga think he can compete, bro. Yo, we gotta we gotta tell this nigga some bad news. He can't compete. Some shit just genetics, my boy. He ain't got them. Feel different once you get in it. Nah, that's fine. What? It's been a week. All right, so it may have been reupholstered. I'm gonna be honest though, it was tight as fuck before. It could have used a little straightening. But my thing about it is like, this is just a crazy a question I got like, how do it like Bro. not to be so deep in it, but pause. So say yeah, pause. That's what but, you said, yeah. But um, like say if your your daughter, you know what I'm saying, she get older. Why does it? I just I just said this, bro. Do man, the kids matter. You know what I'm saying, <laughs> well, but, bro. But, let's but everybody know. can accept that me and my girl, in our own personal life, we could do whatever we want. That's fine. So then people always have to pivot out of it and be like, well, what is your kid gonna think? Yo, see this this nigga right here, bro. Ain't 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 they, ain't he get exposed for like? Talking to a 16 year old. Yeah, this ass a weirdo, man. Like, he always give me weirdo vibes, man. It's some it's something about these niggas we don't know. And y'all be putting these niggas on, on 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 all the popular sites, man, getting these niggas famous. People shit weird as fuck, man. But you that you can't even lie. That's something that probably go across your mind too. But you know? I, I don't think this conversation is harder to have than the conversation about like why me and my girl were doing it on the internet with other women in the first place. Okay, say you know? if it was to come down to it and yo, your daughter do get older and see it. She and will. it's like yeah. and it's like she might have to go to school and deal with people bashing up. Oh yeah, they definitely anything, will. You know what I'm saying? And then it's like it's like especially what you did kind of trickled on to her life. You know what I'm saying? But it's life, though. I get it. You know mm. what I'm saying? I get it, bro. I don't it's get like, it. We only human shit. Motherfuckers do that. But, hey, I will say this, though. Like, don't be surprised in, like, you know, 10 years down the line, whatever, when the little girl grow up, you start seeing, like, you know, she getting bullied in school. You already seen it now. Little kids getting bullied in school because motherfuckers 
you know, they mom or OnlyFans, bitch, you know, they dad doing some shit, like, just some nasty-ass parents, bro. Why you having kids if you're gonna be so freaked out, man? You supposed to be laying low when you got kids. What the fuck? Purpose of what you do, not judging you or nothing. But, right. Because I, I listen like to a, um, other podcasters talk about whatever. That's already weird enough for a kid. But then for them to at some point realize like, oh, also your parents have been naked fucking each other on the internet. And also people hate them for it. People like really fucking hate your parents for having done this stuff. Will it be complicated? Sure. But, you know, Kim K's kids are doing all right, right? Yeah. Are you sure? And also, my kid's but not going to school in South Central. You don't, you don't, you don't know them kids, the country, bro. You don't so know them kids. They could be tweaking right like, now. At the end of the day, it's a profession. That's what I'm they saying. They wouldn't have made it a profession. You know what I'm saying? He talking about some, oh, Kim K's kids doing, you don't know that, bro. I mean, just because she posts her kids dancing on TikTok, don't mean her kids doing well, man. Her kids could be motherfucking tweaking. My pops ain't around. You know, X, Y, and Z. I'm not saying they pops not around, but y'all think just because you see shit on the internet, it's, it's real, bro. People are living a fake life on the internet. It's not real if it wasn't it's, it's it legal for a reason the world is getting more open-minded i'm not saying it's going to be the easiest thing in the world but also i'm not going to turn down millions of dollars right now doing something that i want to do that i'm having fun doing so you just a slave to money that's what you is bro bro i don't get no fuck bro hey hey all my viewers all the my fault <laughs> all my viewers all the people in the world that watch me or just are you know young niggas bro don't be a slave to money bro i know we all want to get rich one day don't be a slave to money. Money should never uh, be the reason you do everything or go, you know, above and beyond and do some shit. Fuck that, bro. I'd rather be a broke, free man than a fucking slave, a rich slave, bro, a pawn. That shit is dead, bro. This nigga's a, a, a rich slave, a pawn, nigga. How you a white slave, nigga? What the fuck? How that work? Just because of the fact that maybe one day my kid is going to have to deal with was saying like when well, i listen to this song and your dad said he had six bodies and he shot so and so in the head and it's kind of similar it'd be a little weird it's just not it's as just, weird it's just different because you, you could say i'm not i'm not advocating for violence though but i'd rather i'd rather them getting niggas say my dad shot six niggas then my dad let my mom get fucked by another man i'm just being honest bro you know you feel me nigga think this is sweet fuck that and his fit trash too nigga lame ass nigga dirty ass nigga White ass nigga, what the fuck? I was just saying shit. But you could actually say it's <laughs> entertainment. Exactly. You know I can't say that. It's kind of just like a I mean, oh, I bro. Let us know acting. what the fuck. It's entertainment. Like we did this for that purpose. It's kind of just like a movie when they got a sex scene or something. It is basically, yeah. But I mean, I enjoyed it. I was there for a reason. Enough of that. You know, I mean, <laughs> enough we, of that. <laughs> leave it alone, man. We ain't, we gonna leave. What's up, y'all? If you like this video, like and subscribe. If you enjoyed this video. Click right here so you can see some of my other videos.